At Machine Concepts, we have approximately 75 full-time employees, 15 part-time employees. Currently, there's seven or eight co-ops out of college working in both on the floor and in the office doing engineering. Experience is not required. We will train people up for, with what they need to know. I enjoy being part of one-of-a-kind equipment builds and processes, seeing things designed, machined, put together, and finished products going out the door, being a part of something new and innovative. Hi, I'm Jerry Brussel. I'm a VMC vertical milling machine operator here at Machine Concepts. We uh, make parts for the steel and aluminum industry, uh, forming metals for a lot of us. Uh, you can just learn on the job if the uh, place of employment has a training. My favorite part is I really enjoy is to take the print and uh, make it to specs and just take a part from a rough burnout or a block to turn into a finished part. I would recommend this profession to young people coming out of school. Very gratifying and like I said, of just taking a block or something and form it into something. Hello, my name's Lewis Modic. I'm a CNC machinist. The main training I did, I did my first two years of high school at Spenceville, regular schooling, and then uh, my last two years, I went to Apollo Career Center in a manufacturing engineering technology course, things that would help me in the future in a career that I'm in now. I got into the machining because I like to do hands-on things. It's kind of what I enjoyed growing up, wrenching on stuff and kind of find the satisfaction in taking a raw piece of material and making it into something. Once I graduated, I had a job starting out full-time in this sort of trade. A typical day, I'll come in, I'll start the machines up, I check all the lubrications, oils, levels, look at my schedule, see what I need to run for the day. So what I do when I go to create a part, the first thing I'll do, I'll take the blueprint, I'll take it over to the computer, and I'll draw that image on the computer in two-dimensional. And after that, I'll choose what tooling I'm gonna use to make that specific part. From there, I generate the tool path on my computer, and then I send it over to my machine I download that program and then I set my tooling in the machine that I'm going to use and I'll run step by step taking it slow to make sure everything clears and uh, to preserve the quality of the machine. We don't want any axes running into each other or knocking anything out of square. They're very precise equipment um, to be able to generate the parts that we're making. Once I do that, I'll do my cuts, I'll measure the part, make adjustments, and then once that first, second one are verified as quality part, you can let it run and do checks every five, 10 pieces possibly, and just maintain that throughout the production run. I enjoy this trade for the fact that I'm always doing something with my hands, I'm using my mind constantly, and I'm always learning as I go. I've been doing this for roughly 16 years and every day I'm still learning something new about the trade. I do like working here. This is a small company here at Machine Concepts. I've been to multiple places right now. And by far, this is the best one I've been to. Everybody knows each other and it's just very family oriented. A lot of our parts are one off, so you kind of have one shot at it. I take a lot of pride in being able to take that and make it on that first shot. If you enjoy computer programming and you enjoy being hands-on, I think this would be a good career. A machine concept's most important is attitude and effort. Dependability to always look to better the company and yourself. Anybody willing to work hard, learn, and be a part of our team can check out our website, machineconcepts.com.